Hello again, it's Carol, wanting to uh, share a mall dive that I had this morning that uh, provided just wonderful, wonderful goodies that I will be sharing with you. But before we do that, I'm, uh, I'm going to skibble up to the edge of a rabbit hole uh, to share with you. Um, this, as you, uh, if you've been keeping up with me, this is my uh, pickup journal, which is, uh, uh, she's now going to be going to a home in, uh, in, in July, so I have to, uh, I have to get cracking. The last video I did, I, uh, I worked on uh, Birdie here, and I wish you could see that that eye is, uh, has a shine to it. Uh, the, uh, I have a middle block about that, the name of that. Uh, glossy accents. And so, that evening, uh, I worked on these two, because I had, if you'll remember, I had three of these cut out. And so I worked on, uh, I worked on these two. And uh, I wanted to, uh, I'm going to add these to my, uh, my trove of uh, ephemera waiting in the background. So, that aside, I finally figured out what's going to happen on this cover. I've been avoiding it. I've been dancing around it. Well, you know that story. So, I've decided that this is going to involve some stitchery. I want to give you a little bit of background on, uh, on stitchery. Uh, the urge, I, I still have that urge, and I wanted to share how I got that urge. This, oh goodness, lights, lights. This is uh, one of my mom's last pieces of uh, crazy quilting. Uh, every every bit of this was uh, was made uh, by her, including the uh, the bottom uh, actual quilting. Uh, this was done for me in. Um, uh, Nine, uh, 19, nine, uh, yes, 1991, uh, just before the uh, macular uh, degeneration kind of uh, put a, a stop on that. But you can see that I do have a, uh, a background in uh, loving stitching. I saw my grandmother and my mom do this kind of work uh, through my whole life. And it was just, I think it was just built, baked into my genes. So, that is... Uh, the background for mom, and this is uh, this is mine. This is the kind of stitching I was doing, uh, but I have to be honest. If you can see the crazy quilt uh, designs that I stitched onto this as the background, and then I added my collection of uh, uh, vintage millinery flowers, etc., etc. Um, However, about, um, oh, I would say five years ago, uh, my bucket list was getting to be a serious because of the number on my birthday, and uh, I realized that I had been uh, stitching like this, well, most of my life, but particularly for about the last 30 years, and I had a great urge to do, uh, to do uh, mixed media. And... I did, and I uh, had to put that as this aside because, as you can imagine, uh, this takes some um, uh, this takes some thinking about and getting really involved with every every little uh, every little bit of this, uh, and so I had to make a choice, and uh, I chose to try something completely new, and of course, choosing things that are completely new uh, are uh, are wonderful for uh, aging heads. So, that is what I put aside, but I still, it's still there, the, you know, the genes are involved. So, this pickup journal, another piece of floor, is going to be visited by uh, the end of my stash of uh, needlepoint canvas. This is uh, this is all that I have. Uh, this is all that I have left. And uh, off on a tangent, 
uh, at this point, uh, I've looked in this box, and uh, when I got it out for you and I opened it, I realized that uh, there is more here than uh, I'm going to uh, I'm going to really uh, use. So I'm going to start to uh, cut pieces to uh, share to share with you. Uh, you can use them um, beautifully for machine stitching on top of this. Um, it works, it works beautifully. But you've seen me do this kind of thing so far, and um, this uh, needlepoint canvas takes, uh, takes wonderfully to what we do. I realize here I have some pink, some yellow, some blue, some dark green, some naturals, a little bit of red, some very, very, very fine, very, very, very fine white. Oh, and look what's hiding here. Okay. And I think this one, I'm trying to make up my mind on the cover. All right, that one would be easier to get to. On the cover of this, there's three shades of off-white here. This is pure white, as you can see. Uh, I'm just wondering which one I might, uh, I might choose. This is one possibility. Let's look and see what we think here. Oh, goodness gracious. It says in the fine print. Why don't we just wreck the place, Carol? So. I'm thinking. I'm thinking this one. Let's look again. Ah yes, I'm going to uh, I'm going to choose this one, and I'm going to uh, do stitchery and uh, apply it to the uh, front of this cover. And as I said, I have to get cracking because uh, she's due to go to her new home uh, in the middle of July. So I just wanted to share uh, these things with you. I have uh, I have absolutely I cannot possibly in my life use all of this, and there is so. Uh, absolutely needs to be shared and it's going to be coming uh, to my shop. So let me put that aside. And share, and share with you my mall dive today. Uh, on Friday mornings I usually uh, put aside uh, Friday mornings to go out and uh, go to Starbucks and get myself a chai which I like and I have the uh, and I have one a week. So I decided, well, I really didn't want to go to uh, to the mall. And then I thought, well, let me go and stop in, in and see. Well, oh, wow. Am I happy that I did. Ugh. This is what came of that mall visit. I really almost had palpitations. I got close and I know all of you would have too. These are so, these are so 1970s, they're just uh, screaming. Well, I thought, in, uh, in this lifetime and the next, I'm not going to use, but I'm certainly, certainly going to share with you uh, on Etsy. Let's, where will I start? How about this pink one? This is so, so typical of the, of the 70s. That's so beautifully stitched. And of course, it's on the finest um, pink mesh that uh, you can conceive. Let's see how wide this one is. This ruler likes to uh, hide from me. This is... Um, two and a quarter inches. So, that was number one. Um, these two are really special, so I'll wait. And this one, I don't think was ever, no one ever purchased it. And look at the price that must have been on this at that time. And uh, 
can one imagine what this would be today? Look, 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 look at this. This is so delightful and soft and uh, so just waiting for our, uh, our journals. So this, of course, will be uh, available soon. Let me go next to this one because this piece is so also so ready uh, as is, but uh, I can just see it uh, coffee dyed, tea dyed, writ dyed, uh, avocado dyed. Oh, isn't this just, just a delight? I love, love, love that one because it has so much potential for what it can become. This one, oh well, this one ripped me completely out of my frame. This, anyone who's lived through the 70s knows that this piece is the cat's whiskers. Each, each of these uh, flowers, each of these florals, which of course could be removed uh, and used individually and uh, look at this would you believe that they took care enough uh, 40 years ago to uh, attach uh, light centers to the dark brown to the brown flowers and uh, brown centers to the uh, to the lighter flowers and uh, so you have this effect this three-dimensional exquisite effect oh. my 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 and it is in beautiful condition. It doesn't even uh, it doesn't even smell bad. It doesn't even smell 40 years of uh, it's not been in dust. It's obviously been taken care of. So that one, this one, well, this one. Anyone who is uh, a lover of aquas and teals and so forth uh, just sees this for uh, for heaven. A little bit of heaven. Isn't this piece just lovely? And this one. This one is uh, an inch. The white is two and a half. They're all about, uh, they're all about two and a half, except of course for this one. So, and here again, not much of this was used. A dollar and 99 cents on the original cost. A dollar and 99 cents for that. Uh, and that was that was big bucks in those days. I know I lived through them, but these two. This was the first thing I saw from across the mall, and it took me right to it. All I thought was immediately, "Cha-ching! Uh, Halloween is coming. Fall is coming. Let me show you this one. Come on, where are you? There it is. Look." Look at this. Is this not absolutely extraordinary? The shade of green is perfect for this uh, orange and this brown. Isn't this just something something for uh, for our journals, particularly at, with the fall coming, although we haven't gotten really into summer yet, but we have to stay a little bit ahead for our seasons. So that is uh, that's that one. This one was way down underneath, and I really, I cannot believe that this one is here. It is the same pattern as this one, but uh, pink, green, and white. My, oh my, oh my. And so, you can imagine that I just could not wait to get home and share and share this find with you. Uh, I'm going to take a bit of it for myself to keep and uh, the rest of it, well, I shall certainly enjoy sharing this with you. I do hope that you have enjoyed uh, uh, seeing the, uh, the plan I have for the cover of the uh, pickup journal um, and this, uh, this mall dive good day in Carol's world. If you have enjoyed, 
please give me a thumbs up, leave a comment, share with a friend, and I would appreciate you subscribing to my channel. Bye now.